and welcome back to the channel in a slightly different environment. Long story, but um, visuals, it's Five Fast Facts. I'm Daniel from The Visual Guys. And this week we're going to take a look at a legendary character in his own right. Uh, somebody that I'm fairly certain Chris did when he did FFFs. But I can't remember and I can't find it, so I'm going with it anyway. But it's Daryl Dixon, uh, the legend himself from The Walking Dead TV series. We'll get into why I'm just saying TV series in the facts. But uh, yeah, this week's video... Videos? This week's video... Can't talk. This week's videos are fucked because, like, I'm having uh, some rearranged stuff. And I need to work out the lighting. It's always been our crypto of the channel, lighting. It's always been awful, even though I have all the, I've got a massive spotlight right here, I've got two there, I've got one set up there, and you just go, darkness, hello my old friend, here's five fast facts all about Daryl Dixon. Um, and a common known fact, but one I'm chucking out there anyway because I love it so much, Daryl Dixon doesn't actually exist in the world of the Walking Dead comic books and stuff. He applied, well, Norman Reedus applied for the role of Merle, but they loved Daryl, they loved, sorry, they loved Norman so much, they made up the character of Daryl Dixon and said, here, we're just going to make up a character because we love you, away we go. Now he's probably, arguably, one of, or if not, the most popular character on The Walking Dead. And because uh, he was an original character by AMC for the TV show, he is now also the longest uh, AMC original character ever in creation, like the, the one that's been out there the longest is what the longest means. The whole poncho look, this one might be obvious, I don't know, uh, I think my mum probably guessed it and I, I was like, oh I recognise this sort of attire, but it turns out that it's an, an inspiration from, it's inspired by Clint Eastwood's The Good, The Bad and The Ugly, you know, the look how Clint Eastwood looks in that with the poncho and stuff, that's what inspired Daryl Dixon's whole poncho look. This one's quite a unique, funny one, because he is actually Robert Kirkman's favourite part of The Walking Dead. Now, bearing in mind, Robert Kirkman is the person that invented and created the world of The Walking Dead, but something that wasn't created by him is his favourite part of The Walking Dead show. Wouldn't you just be a bit like, ah, oh, shit, how have you made something so much better than me? Glad they didn't go uh, this way. Um, because it would have been, I don't know, I think it would have just been shit. But originally they were going to make Daryl a racist drug addict. And of course we've had a lot of different races inside of the main group of The Walking Dead. I, I mean, the dynamics might have set up well, you know, builds some tension and whatnot. But I like the fact that he's everybody's pal at the end, you know, he's, he was hard to, uh, to um, warm up to. And he was a bit like on his own and isolated. And he still is a little bit now, but he's, he's uh, the group's favourite. And one of the OGs, I'm glad they didn't turn him that route. But also as well, I've got, as a side note, as well as that, uh, this one would have been a bit more interesting. But they were going to originally make him gay. Because that got me thinking, I wonder who would have been gay with inside of The Walking Dead. And there you have visuals, that was this Friday's Five Fast Facts. Next week we'll be back with some, with a, another proper, we'll probably go back to there. I'm get, I've got a new bed coming, you see, and I'm going to do some rearranging and whatnot. But hey, visuals, thank you so much for watching. Remember, it's good being you, and keep on, uh, keeping out.